It is opening night, a huge night for both sets of fans. Match day one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. The floodlights are shining down on the players here in Amsterdam at the Johan Cruyff Arena. My name is Derek Ray, and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Ajax facing Atalanta. Well, the first group stage of the Champions League is always exciting. Three points is vital for both teams to get off to a good start. Or a draw may be a good result as well. We're about to find out what happens. No doubt about it, the UEFA Champions League has come a long way since it came into existence back in 1992-93. And there are many, Lee, who say it's the highest standard of football you'll see anywhere. Well, I think it is the best club competition uh, in the world. I think the competition at the top, at the end, near the final, etc., is what it is. But the tournament is strong throughout. The group stages and then the knockout stages, it's the perfect format for me. Well, here's the starting lineup for Ajax. This particular setup is becoming more and more in favour. Yes, Derek, one central striker, two wingers who will provide the width, a very narrow three in midfield, a back four, the two full-backs will be expected to support, but also defend and help out the centre-backs. The starting 11 for Atalanta. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supplying the width as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? Well, match day one in the UEFA Champions League, always exhilarating, and as we look at the group, what might we see in this section, Lee? Well, Liverpool surely will claim the top spot. Lots of strength in depth. I'm a... And he might be through here. And a goal! Not bad for starters. They take an early lead. Connected so well with it, generating a lot of power. And the keeper just can't react in time. Look. A chance to revisit the goal. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Well, not a million miles away. Well, that was great football, Derek. Using their pace to full effect, so close. Lassian Hünterar. So 20 minutes to go. And they might be onto something. Can he put it away? And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. And because he's on his own, he collects himself and he finishes it perfectly past the keeper. Well, 
Well, a second goal for them here. Gozens. Loves to attack from the wide areas. Can't miss, surely. Oh, my goodness. He's caught that so well. A goal of the highest class. Fantastic technique. Well, here's the replay. It's a really dangerous ball into the penalty area. And bang, he doesn't need a second invitation. Beautiful strike to finish. A chance to revisit the goal. And a fine tackle. Tadic. The delivery. And just the header that was required. The goal they were in search of. Well, here's the replay, and it's a great ball into the danger area. But if a player could stand still and nod the ball into the net like that, I would be asking serious questions about my centre-backs. Shocking, really. So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European Cup. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positively. Well, he played well, scored a goal. What a good performance from him. 